What's up everyone? Welcome to the video. Today we're going to take a look at how to replace the battery in this GM remote key fob. So this key fob is the three button version as you can see. If you have the four button version, which will look just like this, except it will also have the remote start button at the top, uh, the battery change procedure we're about to go over will be the exact same. These remotes use replacement battery CR2032. And I'll put a link in the description box of this video to where you can purchase these batteries if you're in need. The other thing I'm gonna be using is a small flathead screwdriver. So if we grab our key fob and we're holding it like this and we take a look down at the bottom near the key ring, we see there's a little bit of a slot right here. And this can be pretty difficult to see, especially if your remote's worn, but it is there. That little notch, that little slot right there. So what I'm gonna do is take my flathead screwdriver and I'm gonna put it in that notch and just carefully work my way up. And I'm kind of prying like this as I'm working my way up and it'll split that shell apart. We can pull the two halves apart and in the back half of the shell, we see our battery right here. So I'll just use my screwdriver to get under the edge of it and get it out of that little plastic holder. Now I'm gonna grab my new battery and I'm gonna make sure I'm installing that with the plus side down. The plus side goes down on the case and snap it in that holder. And then we can snap the two halves of the remote back together. And that's it. If you have any questions, please let me know. If you could take a second to like and subscribe, it helps us out and I'd appreciate it. Thank you.